Hi, Dr. Damon Adams, Editor-in-Chief of Dentistry Today. I'm here with our author, leader, star, Dr. Ross Nash, Thank you. friend, and mentor to so many people. Um, we really appreciate you, Ross. We were just talking. We've been around this industry for a long time. We both graduated in 1978, I think. Yes, we you? did. So we've seen a lot of changes, and uh, they're all good changes, but they're changes. So what do you see here at the show? What's kind of attracted your attention? I don't know. I always like to look at the new materials and products that are out there, and they keep coming. They don't, they're not stopping. So I spend a lot of my time on the floor here looking at uh, all the new stuff. You know, it's yeah. interesting. We were talking about 1978. I mentioned to Ross, I remember at the University of Michigan, we had concise adaptive composites, uh, rubber base, uh, yeah. gold, PFMs, amalgam. That was about it. That's it. But now That's we it. come to the show and we see so many new things. Great, great products. Great composites. Absolutely. Uh, zirconium. We didn't have zirconium back then. Uh, I mean, Lithium to silicate, a strong yes. ceramic. The Emax, uh, that Emax material, uh, and then now we we can actually screw teeth in people's heads now. We didn't do that back then, yeah. so it's no. a it's, it's a, a great cool time, time in dentistry. Cool time to be in dentistry. Yeah. Yes, sir. Well, Ross, thanks a lot for being with us, and thank you, thank you for all the authoring uh, the articles you do. Great articles with dentistry today. Thank you.